a number of players. Kevin, player health is a second chance effort. And he lays it up and in. John Wall. And that's too close. When Wall gets a shot that deep inside, it is almost automatic. At the end of 2020, Steve, this team feels he can be a big part of their future. Yeah, a lot of people were surprised at the size of the contract, Kevin. But it shows how much the three-pointer is valued in the NBA. The Clippers saw he provides a much-needed aspect. Such a shrewd playmaker. Love watching Wall break down the defense. Six points for him. On the sideline, let's catch up with Hall of Famer Celtics David Aldridge. Hey, Kevin, I was able to talk with Teron Lou for just a minute. First looking for foul. his guys to put up a terrific performance tonight, especially at the defensive end. He said, we want to use our length and athleticism to protect the rim and make it hard for shooters to get clean looks. This is the first meeting of the season between these two. Guys, we'll see how it comes. They can do that. They have a great chance to be successful. John That's Wall. going to take great communication out on the perimeter. Expect them to switch quite a bit. Here's Irving. Can't hit from in close. Hmm, I'm not sure what happened on that play. May have relaxed a little bit once he got to the rim. Once he got to the rim. Buries the long-range jumper. John Wall. Wall's got nine. I, I love his shot selection today. He set the bar for the rest of the team. And a little over two and a half minutes gone here in the first. Nice find by... Shoots over Zubats. And Wall gets John it to Wall. go in on the assist by Bagley. 11 points in the game. Yeah, he's in such a great rhythm right now. Makes sense to get him the ball any way you can. Let him decide whether to shoot it, whether to pass it. He's your catalyst right now. Wall's shot is fueled up for the second quarter of basketball. They got Jackson. Isaiah Stewart out there with John Marvin Bagley. And it's Wall, and it's Magruder in at the three. Wall against Irving. Hits the three-point bomb. It is hard to measure and still so vital to winning. Give me some examples in your experience of great leadership. You know, I'll say one example, Kevin. A lot of people think it's on the court. But off the court, leadership really plays a big role on those off days, on those bus rides. Just getting a chance to talk to the younger players. I think that's one. Tighten it up. It did not happen. They never really got into a rhythm despite trying a few different things. Sometimes it's just not your night. Driving in, and that one good. 16 points for him. Gone three of four from the floor here in the second quarter. Inside, Batum with the steal. Irving attacking, and the three. That's good again. His seventh basket, seven for ten from the floor. Good job of stepping up to the plate there, seizing back the momentum for his team. That's the competitor in him. Close game. Let me have this one. Irving passes to Coffey. Tipped away. And Irving throws it down. Over Bagley. Again, the Celtics good for two. Building off a solid first quarter. He's been lights out here in the second. Gone three or four from long range in the game. Shot and game clock separated by five. And Wall kicks to Magruder. There's the pass to Jackson. They've got Patoon. Robert Covington out there with Ivica Zubas. Then it's Luke Kanaw. And it's Wall. Irving in at the point guard position. That's the group starting the second half for Teron Lou. Irving passes to Zubats. Back to Irving. Tent. Here's Bagley. And finish off by Bagley. And the dogged attitude of Bagley. When shots go up, he wants to be the first to pounce on misses. And on the way from Irving for three. Buried from outside. But I don't know. I think we may see a review here. That was pretty close. And we are not going to halftime. Shot to create much separation on the scoreboard yet. Being 71% all in all in this one. They've been brilliant offensively. 
They've got Batum. Robert Covington out there with Ivica Zubas. Then it's Luke Kennard. John and it's Moore. Irving in at the point guard position. That's the group starting the second half for Teron Liu. Irving passes to Zubats. Back to Irving. Hasn't been able to dial it in from distance. He has just the one three, and that was in the first half. Yeah, they're relying on their three-point shooting and getting pretty good results. Batum attacking. To increase this lead. Reggie Jackson's checked in for Robert Covington. Count the bucket, and he's got a free throw coming up as well. This team's struggles are not his fault. He's putting in work at the offensive end. And he'll be shooting his first free throw of the game here. Bounce pass from Olenek. And Clemens stands it home. And you can tell he put a lot of practice into that one. Wall's always ready to break out something slick if he's got the time and space. Pass to Jackson. Irving for three, and Kyrie Irving gets the three. Irving's got 33. Personal Guys, he's been a one-man air raid coming at them time and time again. Yeah, the defense has allowed him to get into a rhythm from there, and he's been relentless. And on the drive, Wall can be so sudden, striking before the defense gets a chance. The fourth quarter has arrived. So good to have you with us. We've got Isaiah Stewart. Jackson is out there with Wall. Then it's Kelly Olynyk, and it's McGee. Shoots the three, and the Celtics hit again from deep. And they have been relentless from deep. And you see the defense trying to react, but to no avail. You know what? They talked about this at halftime, and they're doing a better job of... And you know he was going to try to respond. Those threes canceled each other out perfectly. Irving, good. Just a great hustle play there. Energy and passion. This is what you play the game for. Gotten a success rate of just over 50% from three-point tonight. Four of seven shooting. Jackson has the open look. Kept alive. And the dunk by him. Businesses can't let Urban have his way at the perimeter. With this accuracy, it's lights out. From deep, wall. And out of bounds as the Celtics gain possession. So both teams making some changes here. In this matchup with authority, very decisive. It can definitely be considered a statement win for the Celtics. They really lit it up in this one. Fantastic offensive performance. Definitely just simply shot the ball well. One of those games to be proud of. And the this was just a monstrous performance for Kyrie Irving. Ball was amazing, the level of chaos he caused. Challenging ball handlers, getting into passing lanes, racking up a number of steals that helped demoralize his opponent. Irving from long range. Connect. Here's Irving. Yet another bucket. He's been absolutely ridiculous in this game. You get the sense he just can't miss. It's out of bounds. They are saying it was last touch by Lee. So it's the Celtics now. Just two seconds between shot clock and game clock. Good, another from three, and again for three. And what a fireworks display he's shown us tonight. Just keeps knocking him down from deep. Craig, he has just exploded from beyond the arc. That last make tying him for second in most threes in a game. 